Hey there! Today, we are going to take a step back and explore some fascinating aspects of walking in possibilities. Over 4 to 6 billion people face impossibilities, irrespective of their qualification, profession, positions and wealth. A lot face unbearable, hopeless situations irrespective of their denomination, religion, ministry, career. Now a number of people who encounter these impossibilities eventually strive towards overcoming them. They walk in possibility, but lack the criteria required to be successful to get to their destination. For you to overcome the impossible situation around you, there is a need to understand and process the aspects of walking in possibilities. The aspects of working in possibilities are the criteria to consider. In the process of walking in possibilities alongside God, these include stephaloing, I, believing in the Word of God, 2, having faith in God, 3, appreciating and honoring the Word, 4, having trust in God, believing in the Word of God. In Matt 4 2 4, Jesus said, It is written, Man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of God. The Word of God is the thoughts of God. Heb for 12, the Greek translates the term word as logos, which basically means expression of thought. God expresses his thoughts to man through the word. The word of God is the God-spoken word. It is the word that comes directly from the mouth of God which gives life. According to John 6 to 63, Jesus says it is the spirit who gives quickeneth the flesh profiteth nothing. The word the speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. The word of God is God himself. John 1 to 1 in the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. The Word of God is light. John 1 to 5 in him was life, and the life was the light of men. And the light shineth in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not therefore. To walk in possibilities you have to believe in God and His Word. The Word of God is powerful and is able to equip you to begin to walk in possibilities. Heb, for 12, His Word can transform situations that seems to be impossible to solve, possible within a twinkle of an eye, only if you believe and trust in the Word of God, of the second person in the Trinity, the incarnate person of God. The following are biblical illustrations of the power of the Word of God. When you believe and trust, it changes impossible situations to possibilities. Matt 8, 1 to 3, a man with leprosy came and knelt before him and said, if you are willing, you can make me clean. Jesus reached out his hands and touched the man. I am willing. He said be clean immediately. He was cleaned of his leprosy. Matthew 8. 3 is stretching out his hands towards you today. Saying I am willing to heal you of whatever affliction you are experiencing presently. Thanks for tuning in and don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe for more content like this. Until next time.